guys and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, then welcome, welcome, welcome. My name is Sonia and if you have been here before, then still welcome and my name is still Sonia. All right, in today's video, I am actually going to be tackling our main, I guess, haul closet or coat closet. I'm not really sure what to call this. Basically, the closet when you first walk in that we put all of our shoes, coats, and things like that. I have cleaned this out one time way long ago. And surprise, surprise, it needs a little bit of a facelift. So that's what we're gonna be tackling today. I'm gonna turn you guys around in just a second to give you a before look. But before we do that, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe, all that stuff down below. It would mean so much to me. But now, let's take a look at what we're working with. guys so the first thing I had to do was just to clear out the entire closet and take everything out I guess that's kind of the Kanmari style and I'm not usually a fan of the Kanmari style of decluttering and organizing because I feel like it's very overwhelming to do that on a much larger space but because it was just a closet and it was a pretty small closet it didn't intimidate me at all so I just took everything out and went through it that way but taking everything out gave me a good opportunity to really clean in there vacuum and dust which you'll see me do later on in the video but yeah do whatever works for you guys a total mess before. We kind of just haphazardly threw our shoes in here with no sort of rhyme or reason. It was kind of just, if there's space in the bin, throw a shoe in there. But I wanted to change that and make it a little bit more functional. And I had originally thought about having a bin for each person in the family, since we are a family of four and we have four bins. But I am the culprit that has way more shoes than anyone else, so that didn't work. So instead, I kind of organized this by season, which you'll see here in a little bit. We don't need to, yeah. I don't got time to be thinking about things we can't figure out. Together with you, yeah. I'm getting tired of us constantly. 
Because we live in the Northeast, it can get pretty chilly here during the winter, so we have a lot of jackets and coats and hats and gloves and things like that for the cold weather that are usually pretty bulky and there's no way you can get around that. It is what it is, that's where we live. We also don't have a ton of closet space in our apartment. I mean, it's definitely not the worst on closet space, but we don't have a separate area to keep those heavier items when they're not in season, so I do have to store them in this front closet year round, but I was able to clear out some of the coats that we haven't worn for a while definitely the kids coats that they outgrow it seems like every season so I did clear up some room that way the time finally came for me to kind of clear out this baby bag I loved this baby bag that I had gotten when we were pregnant with our first but Honestly, when we had our second, it wasn't very practical. It was way more, I guess, stylish, which is odd because I'm not a very stylish person, but it was way more stylish than functional. And I found that when I had a second, I really needed something that was hands-free. So I've switched to a backpack since then. So if you are a new mom or you're expecting, I would highly recommend getting a baby bag that is a backpack style. You will thank me in the long run because it is so much nicer to have your hands free. I get too drunk and too scared and lied to you If only you knew I would die for you One of us, one of us gotta say the obvious Nobody loves me better, nobody loves me better Nobody loves me better Guess I'm just Scared to settle down That'd be many nights I got too high and almost left town But there's something about you Something about you I all right, so I wanted to label the shoe bins that I had organized, but the little labels that I got were pretty small and I didn't think I was gonna be able to write out the seasons. So instead I drew little pictures and do not make fun of my poor illustrations. They get the job done and that's all I really care about. Nobody loves me better. Nobody loves me better. Gotta say the obvious Nobody loves me better yet I get too drunk Alright, so I think I actually might make a quick trip out to the store because I was just looking. I got the coats and the shoes in, but trying to figure out what to do with gloves and hats and things like that. I think I want to get a small bin to kind of put right here. That way we can just throw everything in there. And maybe get something up there as well for our spare blankets and stuff like that for when guests come over. Um, I don't know if I'll be able to find something because I won't, it's not like a whole lot of space so I need something that's big enough but shallow enough that I can pull down and get like have it clear the frame. So I'm not sure I'll be that successful but I'm pretty sure I can find a bin for the gloves and the hats and things like that things like that. So I'm gonna make a quick trip out. It, it was just raining pretty hard before. It looks like it's letting up a little bit. It's still kind of raining, but hopefully I can be quick. All right, I'll be right back. Okay, so I ended up just running out to Home Goods and I snagged these rope bins, I guess. You guys have probably seen them everywhere in Target, Amazon, I don't know, they're everywhere. I got these at Home Goods and even though it's packaged as a set of three, each bin was actually a different price. So I didn't realize that at first. I thought it was one price for the set, but 
it wasn't. It was still a good deal, but I thought I was getting a steal of a deal and it ended up not being like that. Anyway, these bins, I'm not sure if they're gonna work in the long run because they weren't as shallow as I needed, but we don't have guests that stay the night too, too often. So I'm gonna see if it kind of works out. And if it doesn't work out, I feel like these bins are practical enough where I can use them elsewhere in the home. So I still felt like it was money well spent. Love you right back. I mean, as much as you can love a hall closet, but you know what I'm trying to say. It just feels so much more functional and I don't have a mini heart attack every time I open it. So I think that's a win. But anyways, I really like it. I hope you guys did too. And if you did, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Do all that stuff down below. It would really mean so much to me. I hope to catch you guys in my next video. So until then, take care.